Hi, I'm Matt from Where the Hell is Matt? I dance badly all around the world. One question I get asked all the time is, of the places I've visited, which are the ones I like the most? So I've used Google Earth to create a tour that shows a few of my favorites. When the jungle crept into the abandoned temples of Angkor in Cambodia, nature improved on what was already a world-class marvel. The trees are now woven into structures that could no longer remain standing otherwise. This isn't just another pile of rocks. Angkor really has a magical quality. A lot of people ask me why, with all of France's art and history, I chose to dance in front of a passing train. The reason is because I'm a train nerd, and the TGV is a really, really fast train, hitting speeds over 500 kilometers per hour. With trains that fast, who needs planes? It's hard to name a specific portion of the Antarctic Peninsula that stands out from the rest, but the steep mountain faces enclosing the Lemaire Channel are pretty memorable. In the summer, massive glaciers calve into the channel's otherwise calm waters as orcas and Mickey whales swim through the narrow passage. Apparently someone decided that building one of the tallest freestanding structures in the world wasn't frivolous enough for Las Vegas. When they finished the Stratosphere Tower, they put an amusement park on top. Once you've had your fill of unchecked hedonism, it's a short drive west into Death Valley and east to the Grand Canyon. Well-known sites like Tikal have been almost completely excavated, but other ancient Mayan cities like Yasha in Guatemala remain concealed under mountains of dirt and will take decades to fully expose. You can still visit Yasha today and watch the workers in action. During a single day in World War II, U.S. bombers destroyed dozens of Japanese warships in the waters around the island of Chuuk. Today you can dive in and explore the haunted remains. The abundant sea life brings a sense of renewal to this historic graveyard. The city of Cape Town in South Africa is often likened to San Francisco. There's certainly a resemblance, both geographically and culturally, but one thing San Francisco doesn't have is a mountain right in the middle. Take the gondola up to the top of Table Mountain and enjoy one of the nicest hikes in the world. So those were a few of my favorite places. To download a Google Earth file with all the locations in this video, go here. Happy travels.